guys it's tori welcome to or welcome back to my channel if you're new here please hit that subscribe button and turn those post notifications so you never miss when i post a brand new video this video is all about me not gatekeeping anything okay i'm gonna tell you guys about the products i use on a regular basis or things i use on a regular basis to make me feel like that girl there's gonna be a bunch of different products and things in here that i'm sharing with you guys that i feel like have really impacted my life i just want to give you guys the tea because 2024 is all about feeling like our best self and feeling like that girl i cannot find a bobby pin to save my life so if you see this little clip i have over here just mind your business okay i'm gonna start with body care because i feel like i have the most things in that category at least as of right now of what i can think of first things first this is one of those things that you don't necessarily need but is it bomb yes okay this is the glossy balm for face and body by patrick ta this is like a glowy balm kind of texture this is in the shade she's glossy this will be perfect for any of you who have like a photo shoot or something i feel like this would photograph beautifully i feel like this will photograph beautifully so if i ever end up having a photo shoot or anything like that this is definitely what i'm going to be putting on my body and it smells really good i can't quite describe what it smells like but it smells really good and it had they have different shades i also wanted to try his like glow body oil but it was never in stock when i worked at Sephora. never never in stock you couldn't even get a little mini one the school bus that's how my brakes sound if you guys want to know a fun fact my brakes sound just like that this is such a baddie thing to have also if like you put diamond bomb on top of this stop playing this is definitely more like red carpet photo shoot places we're going to be taking photography i'm almost certain that's like the area and realm he uses it in you know what i mean also i have his bronzer and blush on my face today i'm a patrick ta girly down i don't know what it's been lately like i don't know what he put in his products the packaging is cute it's like that pink color he's just been eating the next things i'm gonna put these two together are the l'ocetan i do not know if that's how you say that this is the hand cream and this is the cuticle oil i don't know why a cuticle oil and a hand cream have completely changed my life now granted for a hand cream you could just use any lotion but cuticle oils of any kind really just elevate your look now this is like a little subtle thing that you might not think you need or you might not think about but it is definitely something that you need to implement into your routine oiling your cuticles so, you know my mom does nails and i didn't even realize like how big a difference cuticle oil makes my nails are not filled in right now but i put cuticle oil on so they just look a little less dusty this is literally huge so i just keep this in my house but i always keep these on me this combo i keep it on me okay i have multiple sticking with the same brand of loacetan the shower oil i've talked about this on my channel before i started using this when i worked at ulta because everybody was talking about it your skin is going to feel so soft you're going to feel so hydrated i also like to shave with this your skin is just going to feel so good you're going to be so shiny and it's just smell good if you like almonds if you don't like almonds don't get this because it definitely is very almond heavy hence the name these next two things i'm also going to share together i have talked about way on my channel before and i love their products this is the body cream this is the body wash in the saint bart scent like i told you guys before it really just whisks you away it feels like you're on a tropical vacation i was never one for like those beachy tropical smells until i smelled this this has changed my life way you need to make a perfume if you hear me if you're listening please do me a solid and just make a perfume i started using this also when i worked at sephora when i bought it for the first time my manager was like you're going to have the best shower of your life when you go home like i kid you not they're just so luxurious which they better be for the first point next thing i want to talk about that i don't have on me is the fenty butter drops lotion wise best lotions ever this is vanna cream if you are somebody that has eczema like myself or you just struggle with really really dry skin this is going to be amazing for you i put this all over my body and it has really really helped with my eczema along with something i actually can't take out of my shower because it's a shower head a jolie when i moved to georgia i felt like my skin just got worse i had always had eczema i feel like the water really worsened it or something like that and the minute i got a jolie i swear the eczema on my legs has gotten so much better it's like patches of dry skin like that would not go away no matter what i did it would not go away and i didn't start noticing a difference and an improvement until i started using my jolie i just recommend a filtered shower head period i do self tan if you guys did not know just so i can look a little more like golden and bronze I, when i was a kid i was so tan and i immediately just lost all of my pigment as i got older unfortunately my dad did not give me any of his melanin i just look so dry and decrepit and pale in the winter and i just don't like that i just self tan here and there this is the shade ultra deep bronze but y'all it really doesn't even give ultra deep bronze it's not super dark i do not like looking orange this is from jergens i've used this one multiple times but 
I'm not too picky on self tan. I also like B tan because theirs have a green base to it. So it gives you more of that olive tone like you were laying out in the sun. I'm gonna talk about a few perfumes I really like. I'm gonna keep this short and sweet just because I do have a video I just posted about this on my TikTok. This is Kaoli Vanilla 28. Don't know how many times I have to tell you guys this is my favorite fragrance of all time, but it's my favorite fragrance of all time. If you are a vanilla gourmand girly, this is going to be your absolute best friend. And then YSL Libre Intense. I love anything YSL. I also like Valentino's fragrances. And then this one, this one I know you guys are probably excited to hear a little bit of a review about because I know you've seen it all over TikTok. This is the Yara Latafa perfume. It smells so good. It layers so well with so many different things and I've gotten tons of compliments every single time I wear this. So this is definitely a 10 out of 10. I did get it off the TikTok shop, which pains me to say that I fell victim to the TikTok shop. I never thought it would happen to me, but it's like once you get on there, it's like you can't you can't stop okay you can't stop but you can get it on amazon i think as well I don't know what to what are you looking at speaking about clementine i do want to take a brief intermission to let you guys know about my cat if you follow me on instagram or tiktok then you would know i talked about my other baby leo he's actually in the other room just because we like to isolate them a little bit while he is sick we're trying to push through whatever god throws our way we've definitely been praying a lot we've definitely been praying for him a lot and we are optimistic about his situation prayers up to my baby leo y'all like his birthday is in a couple days so it's just been a really emotional time I'll let you guys know we're pushing through and we're okay and he's okay now i'm going to talk about skincare things i don't have the box with me it's literally a in the other room but this is the dr dennis gross peel pads if you have any texture on your face that is going to help to get rid of it they have three different kinds that are formulated for different skin textures so there's literally one for everybody it is a little pricey so i would buy it now during the sephora sale okay i have become a bit of a skincare connoisseur i have lots of skincare i try so many different things all of the time just because i like to see what works and what doesn't i don't know what miss Haley Rowe bieber baldwin put in her skincare but it is really, really good. I love this pineapple cleanser. This is glazing fluid. I do have a couple other things from her and I love every single thing I've tried. These are good for my girlies on a budget who don't want to buy the ordinary. And I've also, if you're looking for something on the budget, good molecule. If you're a Sephora shopper, this is where you can get this brand from. This was one of the most popular skincare brands when I worked at Sephora. I love their product. Different, they do have like different product lines that are formulated for different things. Like they have kind of like an acne line, a dry skin line. So I ended up getting this because I heard it was really good for dry skin and it has been. It's super thick and gentle. So if you deal with like dry patches and things like that, this is going to be bomb for you. Also because it has oat in it and oat is soothing. This is a omega water cream and a caffeine eye treatment. So if you struggle with dark circles, puffiness, caffeine is going to be good for you. And then the omega water cream leaves you feeling really hydrated without leaving any greasy residue behind because I hate that I don't want to feel greasy I want to be hydrated I want to look hydrated but I don't want to feel greasy you know this is very pricey so Sephora sale it now this is the Clarence double serum I put this on as part of my skin prep for my makeup also like La Roche Posay I like them as a brand um this is the Cicaplast balm this is really good for the girlies with really disgustingly dry skin like myself I like to put it on my nose or just anywhere where I need extra hydration we're gonna move into makeup that I really really love I can make a whole video about like self-care treatments on a budget but I do get my lashes done here and there but when I don't have them done I do the DIY cluster lash things this is the B and Q Bond. This is the best one I've tried. I've tried so many. I've tried False Care. I've tried other Amazon brands. This is my favorite. They last so well. Like, like I can like tug on them and they're not going anywhere. You know what I mean? I can't pronounce this, but they are Amazon lash clusters. I know this brand is B and Q. We're gonna go to a lash tech. Make sure they customize it to your eye shape. That is so important, and that will let you know what kind of lash tech they are. Okay, because customizing it to your eye shape is key because the same set of lashes is not going to look the same on everybody. I actually really like these new Rare Beauty blushes. I use them as blush toppers. This is in the shade Happy. It's what I used today. It just has such a nice sheen to it along with the blush color because it's a mixture of her highlights and her blush, of course. Honestly, I love anything Hourglass. I love this setting powder. Makeup is different because I can honestly go on about makeup for so long. So I'm just showing you kind of like the heavy hitters in my life right now. Like I mentioned, anything Patrick Ta, this is his bronzer and she's bronzed and i also used his blush today they are just such good products i'm not sponsored by patrick Dow. i'm not getting paid to say this makeup artists that make makeup brands like makeup by mario they just know what they're doing they know because they've tried so many different brands of makeup and they've used it on so many different people various skin types various skin tones they know what they're doing and that's why i just i i just 
concealer I have on right now also is the Milk Future Fluid Concealer in 9N. If you have dry under eyes like me, this is very hydrating. To talk a little bit about hair, even though I normally wear my hair curly, I have it straight for this video. Normally I wear a curly, but this is what I've been washing my hair with regardless of straight, curly, whatever. I've been using the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Bond Building Shampoo and Conditioner. I like to switch my shampoo and conditioner up every so often just so my hair doesn't get like too used to what's going on. But you guys know if you follow me on Instagram, people come for me. People come for me about like my breakage and my damage and stuff so i'm trying my best to repair that. i've been loving this lately i love anything from rizzo's curls this is the vitamin c hair repair mask i can't really attest to the benefits because i've only used it a few times but the scent alone sells me i love when hair products have scents that linger i know a lot of people don't like that oh my god it's not good for you fragrance unfortunately i just want to smell good one of the last things in the hair category which i feel like a lot of people don't think is a necessity but i love it rizzo curls hair perfume this is perfect for spring and summer perfect they want to talk to you guys about my let me chill gummies but i can't find them i know some people on tiktok said it doesn't work for them but when i say they relax me i feel like you have to like be feeling an immense amount of stress for it to help calm you down but i am such an anxious person and i go through lots of stress sometimes so they really work for me another thing i want to talk about is this light the alex earl really a light i got this off of amazon i didn't get it off the tiktok shop but everybody i know loves this anytime i've taken this anywhere when i say people have been like oh my gosh you're a blessing this is the best light i've ever used in my life i've taken some of my best pictures with this light and so this is a concert last february and the girls are trying to take pictures and i literally went my person was like do you want my light girl oh my god if you guys want a part two of this video just let me know and comment down below i love you guys so much i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll catch you guys in the next one